and welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Priscilla and this is a carnivore journey and welcome to week 49. If you are new to my channel, I just wanna say hello and welcome and thank you so much for taking the time to tune in today. And if you have been following along with me on this wonderful journey for the past 49 weeks, thank you so much for your continued support. I definitely could not do this without each and every one of you. Can you believe that we are in week 49 on this journey, this new way of eating that we call carnivore. I'm so excited. In just a short few weeks, I'm going to be wrapping up my year. So I hope that if you are new to my channel, that you will make sure that you turn, tune in on week 52 when I wrap up my whole year and tell you why I started carnivore, um, what I accomplished while I was on carnivore, and so much more. So let me tell you a little bit about this week, and then I'm going to tell you about my weight. So let's get started. This week, was a really good week. I only had to work Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and then of course we were off Thursday for the 4th of July. So I had a long weekend, and I was very excited about that, and I was very much looking forward to a very nice break. So on Wednesday evening, after we all got home from work, we had a birthday party because it was my stepson's birthday, and we celebrated, had a great time, and then that evening we went off and we got him something extra special. We had steak that night, and I wasn't fasting. I had fasted the week before and decided that I was just going to enjoy this week for what it was. And then on Thursday, we continued to celebrate birthday and then we went over to families where we celebrated 4th of July as well. I am very grateful that our family is so supportive when it comes to our carnivore journey. So we never feel left out. There was more than enough for us to eat and everything was carnivore approved. We had steaks, we had ribs, we had boiled eggs, we had assorted cheeses, we had hamburger patties, and everything was wonderful. The kids had a great time, everyone swam, everyone celebrated birthday, everyone celebrated 4th of July. I am very grateful. We never felt, we never feel left out, and there's always plenty for us to eat as carnivores. Friday, we just had a great day, uh, woke up early that day, did a few things around the house, and then of course I made a steak lunch for, for everyone here at the house. We had steak, we just continued to hang out at the house. It was kind of like a mini vacation and that's exactly what I thought about it. Philip didn't have to work this week and so he was in vacation mind and I was too. So we just enjoyed it for what it was. Um, later that night we went to the movies and of course, because we're not able to eat anything that the movies offers, we had to make sure that we ate beforehand. Then Saturday we just kind of chilled around the house, we relaxed just enjoyed the day as it was. And then of course, Sunday, we got to babysit our granddaughter, which was amazing. And she just keeps us busy. And we were running around with our heads cut off with her this weekend. I just wanna say we had a great weekend. We ate wonderful foods. Um, I did indulge this week. I just allowed myself to enjoy the holidays and birthdays and celebration and just my mini vacation. So when I did my weigh-in, I did go up a couple of pounds. So I'm back up to like one, almost 154, but that's okay. I just fasted pretty much all day today. I, I did OMAD today, so I just did one meal a day and I'm just gonna continue to do that. And I still have about two or three more weeks until I do my final weigh-in. So I'm not gonna put so much pressure on me and I'm hoping that I will reach my goal and get down to 150, but when it comes to the holidays, I'm going to sit back, relax, and enjoy, but I will make sure that I stay within the carnivore guidelines. So I just want to say, I hope that all of you had a wonderful 4th of July. I would love to hear what y'all have been doing so far this summer. And if you are new to carnivore, I would just love to hear where you started, what was your weight, what was your goal, and what is it you want to get out of this journey that you are currently on. Please leave a comment in the comments section. And don't forget, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any more of my videos. So I hope you all have a wonderful week. I know that I plan on having a wonderful week. I did have a wonderful week. And until I see y'all, my name is Priscilla. This is The Carnivore Journey. Bye.